Hey, what's poppin' kings and queens? Royal Gilly here from Team Royal Gaming. First off, holy fuck, thank you guys so much for the support on the last video. I was scared to upload it, because I was just like straight up honest, and I thought people might take it the wrong way. Nobody did, though. I thought people would take it as, uh, oh no, he's not gonna upload anymore, his videos are gonna change drastically. Hell nah. Nah, uh But, uh, I mean, hopefully soon. I have a goal, okay, to create this channel a certain way and it's not gonna happen for a little bit but once I'm there you'll fucking know it involves in real life videos okay anyways delicious cream donuts nice says how to say no to ugly chicks and that's kinda fucking harsh I mean god <laughs> how to say no to the perfectly okay females that you're just not necessarily interested in okay the reason I wanna talk about this is because hey your boy had to deal with this a little bit, and it's fucked up, because I fucked up. I fucked up bad. And it put me in a weird, awkward, really uncomfortable situation. A position for like two years that I really didn't want to be in, so I need to shed some light to you guys so you don't fucking... Ugh. <laughs> Go through what I went through. So this was back when I was in middle school. Seventh or eighth grade, and there was this girl who had a total fucking crush on me, right? Liked me a lot, would always be messaging me, but she wasn't really my type. She wasn't in the, not only, like, you know, attractiveness. And it's, I just feel fucked up, man, because people's emotions are precious, especially females. So it's like, I hate to be so straight up and honest, but she wasn't attractive and, like, I wasn't going to fucking really get into it. But at the time, in middle school, uh, this dude comes up to me, right? This was some pussy shit, obviously, and she, he's like... Yo, this girl really wants to go out with you, man. You got it. You have to. And after, you know, convincing me for a little bit, he's like, he was like friends with her or something. He's like giving me gum and shit and like, you know, really, really almost bribing me to say yes. And I was like, okay, you know what? Fine. I don't have a girlfriend and I like having a girlfriend. So I'm going to go out with this girl. And man, boy, do I regret that because I didn't like her at all. She really, really crushed hard for your boy, Royal Gilly, which is understandable, you know. I mean, I understand. But it got to the point where I, like, kissed her. And my friends gave me so much shit. Now, not that that matters, but it's like I almost had to give myself shit because, like, I just felt so guilty and I couldn't say no. I couldn't just be like, hey, you know what? I don't like you. Or at least, you know, come up with some excuse because I really was leading her the fuck on and that's kind of the advice I want to give is like first off hold on first off your first option is to say fuck it and get yourself some low grade pussy okay but regardless you could still like date her and see how it goes okay obviously that's not what you want to hear and that's not what you want to do because you don't like this girl you have to be straight up don't lead her on don't like beat around the bush and like keep talking and like just push it to the side, change the subject, because that's what I would do. And it just kept going on until the point where I felt guilty. I was like, hey, fuck, okay, I'm dating this girl. I'm going to do it because I feel bad. Which is actually more fucked up. Like, at the time, it might seem right to be nice to her and stuff, but you're going to have not only a girl that likes you, but a girl that's emotionally invested now and really into you, and it's just going to hurt worse when the truth finally comes out. Um... You could lie. This is a situation where it's okay to lie and be like, hey, I like this other girl, or hey, my parents don't let me date, or hey, I don't want a girlfriend, it's not because of you, da-da-da-da. Or you could wreck this girl's whole entire life and her whole self-esteem. As long as, I mean, that probably won't happen, but you'll hurt this girl if you're completely straight up. Hey, I don't like you. Hey, I mean, I just don't think we'd be a good couple. Like, that shit's gonna hurt, because you know what it's like when you crush and, like, you really want that person and then they're not interested in you, it's like, huh, that fucking sucks big black cock. But that's what you got to do. Don't lead them on. Don't be pulling the let's just be friends card because, I mean, all that's fucked up. You just have to come up with an excuse and this girl will leave you alone if you ask her too nicely. But please, guys, please don't be dicks. Be nice. Be careful with these young girls' hearts. We don't need a bunch of... Sad young girls walking around our planet. I think there are enough of those. But yeah. Don't pull the friend card. Be straight up. And uh. Or. And uh. Or. Go with the girl. And do it like your boy Royal Gilly did. Get some make out sessions. And feel guilty about it later. But uh. 
yeah hope you guys enjoyed this video click the like button and leave suggestions down in the comments below for what you want to hear from your boy love you kings and queens thanks for the support